In a sea of mattresses that all seem the same, it can be really hard to choose the right mattress for you. The Airweave mattress is not like any other mattress I've reviewed before because it has no foam, there are no springs. Instead, it's a minimalist, futon style mattress made in Japan. In today's video, I'm gonna help you decide if the Airweave mattress is for you. Subscribe to Unbox Mattress if you love sleep too. If you're looking for a firm yet supportive mattress and you do not like the feel of memory foam, keep watching. The Airweave came in two boxes and it comes in pieces that you assemble and then zip up into the bed. The Airweave mattress comes in three big rectangles. This is a queen size. The great thing is it's made to be modular, which means that if you move a lot or if you want to store this away when you're not using it, you can unzip the cover, take out the pieces and stack them. If you want to see the unboxing video to see what it was like to put this together, I'll put a link to that above and also in the video description. They call this the new Airweave mattress and I have a queen size and if you want to check it out, I'll have a link in the video description below. Let's talk about the basics. First, the sleep trial, it is 100 days. That means that you have 100 days to try this out and if it's not for you, you can get a full refund. You should know though that they require that you spend at least 30 days before you return it or you'll be charged a fee. A new mattress, it's always gonna feel different to you. Even if your old mattress is awful, you're used to it and so you do need to give it time. I like to take a Tylenol PM when I'm testing a new mattress because I just anticipate that it's gonna feel different and weird to me. But I think it's worth it to give it enough time, especially because I expect this mattress to last a long time. This is not a material that's gonna break down easily. Now let's talk about what this is made out of and the layers. The first layer is this breathable cover. On one side, it's kind of a polyester mesh and it makes it totally breathable. And on the top, it's perforated also for airflow and breathability. And then on the sides, it has this binding that's really nice quality and a good quality zipper. So you can completely remove and wash this cover. The next layer is a stretchy fire sock. This is unusual because usually the fire sock cannot be removed and it's completely sewn on. This one is um, meant to wrap around the pieces. This fire sock is actually thicker, stretchier, and, and more substantial. It just covers the sides and it Velcros on one side. The ends are open. And then it has those three rectangular blocks which they call air fiber, which is woven polyethylene. It's very clean and sanitary, way more than foam. Tell me, can you clean the inside of your mattress? I didn't think so. The next layer is a pad or a, they call it the soft layer and it is made of polyester and it just adds some softness, not a lot, it's not very thick. That It also can absorb liquids and it's another way to keep the mattress clean because you can throw that in the wash too. But reading the different comments from people, this mattress has really helped their aches and pains. They have loved it and it, one thing that I wondered about the pad is if one of the purposes is so that you can't feel the separation between the rectangular pieces and the air, the air fiber blocks, you cannot feel the seams. But this material seems to stay together pretty well. Um, with this material, I didn't find that at all. It was one thing that I was kind of curious about. This is a lower profile mattress, meaning that it is a thinner one and it is a lighter weight. And all this airflow without any foam, no memory foam, means that you're not gonna sleep hot even if you're a heavier person. And that tends to be a problem with heavier sleepers. They sink into the foam and then it heats up and gets too warm. Because this is a more firm bed, you're not gonna sink in very much and you're not gonna get hot. You're also not gonna bottom out, which means you're not gonna compress through the softer layers quickly and then hit the firmer layers. The firmer layer is the only thing there is. It also means that you're not gonna get that stuck feeling when you sink into foam and you can't move very easily. This one is very responsive because again, it's very firm. You can easily move and change position. Edge support. I'm just gonna start here. I'm gonna go all the way to the edge. And there's not a lot of compression there. And then I'm gonna show my edge right here. Ah. You will roll off if you get too Over close. Here, let's just, I'll just show you side sleeping. This is how I sleep. So if you're a side sleeper, Go on my back. Okay. My stomach. I'm not a stomach sleeper at all, but I 
I actually really like the feel of this on my stomach. It doesn't sink in on my hips or stomach at all. This stuff, I'm just gonna pull this up. Just has this, I mean, little pieces that are woven together. This is stretchy and a really unique material. Fishing line was one of the inspirations for the design. The founder and CEO took over his uncle's fishing line company, experimenting with resin fiber used to create fishing line, and he discovered that it was perfect for a mattress. Okay, this is a hand test. My hand does not leave any kind of indent at all. It just bounces right back up. Here is the air fiber. This is the most unique material as I was showing you, there's no compression right here. There is on the edge, but not that much. It doesn't go down very far. It bounces right back up. And I can literally put my finger through it because there's mostly air because this is woven air. A lot of the mattresses I've reviewed don't have any kind of study so they can prove in any sort of way. There are several studies about the performance of airwaves and how there aren't any hot spots in the mattress like memory foam can have. And the fact that it's breathable and sleeps cool. And for me, I really like the cleanliness because every part of this mattress can be taken apart and washed. You usually think the cover could be washed or maybe a pad that this literally could be washed even the inside the main part of the mattress is mostly air and you can actually take it apart and you can wash it in the shower in the bathtub or hose it off in the garden if you want to use a mattress protector this is only about eight inches tall overall so you're going to have to find a low profile mattress protector because this is a low profile mattress and I feel like because it is so washable, you wouldn't have to have a mattress protector and you wouldn't need a waterproof one, but it'll still make cleanup a lot easier. I'll put a link to a low profile mattress protector in the description below. 2020, they were to supply roughly 18,000 beds for athletes to use in the Olympic Village at the 2020 Tokyo Olympic Games. Because of COVID, the Summer Olympics were postponed until 2021. Who is the Airweave mattress good for? It's great if you're a heavier sleeper, if you like a firmer mattress, if you sleep too hot and want something that doesn't retain heat, that sleeps cooler, and you like a lower profile, minimalist type of look. For me, I'm a little bit of a clean freak and I love the fact that you can wash all of it. And if you have allergies or any issues like that, this is a great bed for you.